I've had requests from people to offer the Rocky Mountain Bear Claw class again. And since it's one of the quilts that I love the most, and whenever I put it on my coffee table at home and I have company over, I always get the most amount of compliments from this table runner. I thought, yeah, let's run it again. It's been a while since we've run it. So if you've not taken one of my Judy Niemeyer classes before, this is a great opportunity to learn some paper piecing using her techniques. And the quilt looks like it's complicated, but it's got nice gentle curves. I'll show you lots of tips in order to figure out how to do them, and you'll be surprised at how well it goes together. We, in the pattern, you will get six bear claws, so the actual squares. I took three of mine and made a table runner, and then I took the fourth one that I made and made it into a pillow. You have the option, if you want, that you could use all six of them and put them together and make a bed runner, or you could do the four if you've got a long table. It's up to you. I actually did a second one of the bear claw and I put four of them together in a square. And so I made that because I have a square coffee table in our family room. It's really lots, a very versatile pattern. Um, in this class, we're also going to be working on partial seams. So if you've never done partial seams before, this is a great opportunity to learn how to do them. And it's just a really fun one to do. And so I'm Brenda Boychuk, and please come and join me for my class.